What's going on YouTube? Andy here, Cut and Clean Lawn Care. I just want to talk about something simple that I created compared to spending, you know, $200 for a stripe kit for my walk behind. Um, it's striped decent without a stripe kit on it, you know, but I really wasn't looking forward to spending $200 to get a stripe kit put on a mower. I mean, it's $200. When you're in business for yourself, you own and operate your own business, $200 goes a long way towards anything. Now, most of the customers I have don't care if their yard's striped or not. They're just looking to get it mowed weekly, bi-weekly, elderly people. But I still like to do my best, keep the yard in as good shape as possible. I mean, these people, they don't even care about fertilization or weed and feed or any of that stuff. So I was gonna run you through a quick little striping kit I made for my 36 inch walk behind. And I think it does a really good job. And I mean, you might get some ideas to some stuff you can do on your own or with any lawnmower. So yeah, check it out. Now this right here is an Encore Premier Series commercial grade 36 inch walk behind. Now, personally, I'm a fan of the walk behinds. I'm a fan of standards too. But for what I'm doing in the yards I get and the neighborhoods I take care of, 36 inches is the way to go. All the yards are pretty small and a lot of them still have those old 36 inch man gates on them. Did not come with this right here when I bought it. This is what I created, my little striping kit for this mower. It's just two L brackets hooked into a 90 degree metal, all 36 inch, the, the rubber, everything's 36 inch. Just bolted to the frame, it's about quarter to a half inch thick rubber you're gonna want something pretty heavy gray that way it's not gonna get torn up and it's gonna do a better job of laying that grass down because when it comes to striping that's all you're looking for is just something to either lay the grass down or roll the grass down with a roller yeah that's it now let me show you what it looks like this is my lawn by the way bought the house and it came with a good mix of clover and fescue and weeds which I have slowly gotten back into some sort of shape. But yeah, simple, easy. Now with a yard like this, my yard's a little bigger. I'm on a corner lot for where I'm located. But yeah, I would definitely want like a 48 or something a little bigger with stripes like this. But for what I'm doing, the 36 is perfect for my world in lawn care. So yeah, simple, easy. If I could give you any information, it'd be just try to come up with some stuff on your own. You can spend all the money you want on striping kits, but when you can create something yourself, it's more, more gratifying. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll be trying to post more videos on this channel. Just something to do while I'm out there doing my business. Lawn care gets old. Seen a ton of videos on here. Geek to Freak, B&B Lawn Care, whoever it is. Just something fun to do. Something to break the monotony, so... I might have some more videos like this coming on the way. So yeah, subscribe, like, comment, and uh, join me on my adventure in lawn care.